Hello beautiful people. Today is a book review of how to make people like you in 90 seconds by Nicholas Boothman. Here are some of the things you will learn in this book. First impression is crucial. In today's society it is really important to learn how to make people like you. You can make more friends and network better with people that later will help you reach your goals easier and faster. People easily form their opinions about us just after few seconds of our conversation with them. Hence it becomes necessary for us, to form a good impression at start only and to capture their attention at the same time. This can be really very useful for your personal and professional life. Most of the people fail to understand, what they must talk when they meet someone for the first time. And this makes them nervous and they start behaving awkward. The meeting. We call the first few seconds of contact the greeting. Greetings are broken into four parts, open, eye, beam and lean. These actions constitute a welcoming program to carry out in a first encounter. The first part of the greeting is to open your attitude and your body. For this to work successfully, you must have already decided on a positive attitude that's right for you. This is the time to really feel and be aware of it. Check to see that your body language is open. If you have the right attitude, this should take care of itself. Keep your heart aimed directly at the person you're meeting. Don't cover your heart with your hands or arms and, when possible, unbutton your jacket or coat. The second part of the greeting involves your eyes. Be first with eye contact. Look this new person directly in the eye. Let your eyes reflect your positive attitude. To state the obvious, eye contact is real contact. Get used to really looking at other people's eyes. When you're watching TV one evening, note the eye color of as many people as possible and say the name of the color to yourself. The next day do the same with every person you meet, looking him or her straight in the eye. 3. Beam This part is closely related to eye contact. Beam Be the first to smile. Let your smile reflect your attitude. Now you've gained the other person's attention through your open body language, your eye contact and your beaming smile. What that person is picking up subconsciously is an impression not of some grinning, gawking fool though you may briefly fear you look like one, but of someone who is completely sincere. Hi. Whether it's hi, or hello. Say it with pleasing tonality and attach your own name to it. Hi. I'm Naomi. As with the smile and the eye contact. Be the first to identify yourself. It is at this point, and within only a few seconds, that you are in a position to Gather tons of free information about the person you're meeting information you can put to good use later in your conversation. The final part of introducing yourself is the lean. This action can be an almost imperceptible forward tilt to very subtly indicate your interest and openness as you begin to synchronize the person you've just met. Establishing Rapport How We Build Rapport Establishing rapport in 90 seconds or less with another person or group, be it in a social or community setting or with a business audience or even in a packed courtroom, can be intimidating for many people. It has always amazed me that in this most fundamental of all life skills, we've been given little or no training. You are about to discover that you already possess many of the abilities needed for making natural connections with other people. Forming rapport will help us to create emotional connection by understanding others' feelings and emotions. So now I will share some points to form a strong rapport. Number 1, Attitudes Sometimes while talking to your close friends or family you realize that they are sad or angry. You ask them what happened is everything okay? At that moment, they give a fake smile and says yes everything is okay to which you don't believe and later you come to know that yes you were thinking right about his or her emotion. Well because of some reasons we come to know that they are lying. 
But have you ever though what is that reason through which we come to know that something is wrong? So answer for this is, because of their attitude. Because our attitude directly impacts our mind and our mind is fully connected to our body. So what happens, if your attitude is full of anger? No matter how nicely you try to talk, but people will understand. Your anger through facial expression, through your voice tone and through your body language which will not allow you to build a rapport. To the art of synchronizing. Think of synchronizing as rowing your boat alongside another person's rowboat, pointing it in the same direction at the same speed and picking up the other person's pace, stroke, breathing. Synchronizing body language falls into two loose groupings, matching, which means doing the same thing. As the other person, she moves her left hand, you move your left hand, and mirroring, which means, as it implies, moving as if you were watching the other person in a mirror, he moves his left hand, you move your right. Mirror their energy in a fish EC. So you can notice, that people with common interest easily gel up with each other and become comfortable to each other easily and form connection. Why this happens? Because we love to spend time with those people who are like us or have same interest like us. People who have similar thinking, have similar ideas about life. Not always but most of the time, our bonding will be less with those people who are opposite to us. Hence if we synchronize with others, or if we do things like them. This thing will really help us to form rapport. I will not talk about thoughts and ideas, it can differ. But I will talk about some practical things which can be similar to all. Which we can easily sync and can form connection to the other person. Mirror their body language, don't make it obvious. Communication In face-to-face -face communication, it's not enough to command the other person's attention. You must also be able to hold on to it long enough to deliver your message or intention. You will capture attention with your likability, but you will hold on to it with the quality of rapport you establish. More and more it comes down to three things, one, your presence, what you look like, and how you move, two, your attitude, what you say, how you say it and how interesting you are, and three, how you make people feel. In order to communicate with others, we must focus on first, visual, two, vocal, and third is verbal. 55% of our communication is based on visual things. To be specific, depends on body language. 38% communication depends on our voice tone. And only 7% depends on your verbal communication. It's conversation time. Conversation is one very significant way to build rapport and forge the bonds of friendship. It comes in two equally important parts talking and listening. Or, as you'll soon see, asking questions and actively listening. Ask questions. Because how else will you keep the conversation kicking? When engaged in a conversation with someone, be sure to ask them questions about themselves. People generally like to talk about themselves, so it is fairly easy to get people to like you by being a good listener and taking interest in what they are saying. They'll never notice they did most of the talking until it's too late. On the other hand, make sure you bring up some interesting things about yourself as well. To keep the conversation open and reciprocal. You want to ask open-ended questions, that can't be answer with a yes or no, and show your commonalities and personality, too. Attract anyone in less than 90 seconds after meeting them. Build rapport with people you appreciate. Sometimes you need other people to like you for various reasons. Maybe you just need a friend or a good business preposition. So communication skills are so important when it comes to our daily needs and success. There are various benefits that comes with good relationships with other people. Thank you for watching, 
and please subscribe to our channel.